<laughs> so, um, we have some mixed news for Persona 5. First off, obviously, you can see it is delayed. But what boggles my mind is that it's not just 2016, you know, it's not early 2016 or anything. It's summer 2016. And summer can range from like May till about August, even September for some time. And the reason how we know is they actually, this is the good news, they gave us a three minute trailer, basically a four minute, and it shows a lot. I'm talking a lot of stuff. This is the longest, this is the greatest one ever shown. Um, the one that we that was not officially released was not even that good. You know, it didn't show a whole lot of new stuff. But um, this one shows a lot and it answers a lot of questions people have. Um, one big thing is that your personas, they're basically, um, what's it called? You can see what persona you're using by your mask. You know, each different masks have our different personas, basically. So that, that's a big, pretty news and cool thing. I may break down the trailer um, later on, you know, later on. Probably I will within the week, this or next week, I'll break down the trailer. But for now, I just want to let you guys know about the delay. So the fact that John Harden has been pushing the date of 2015 so much, you know, every after E3, he said 2015. After GamesCon, he said 2015. Basically, after every, after every time somebody, some big event happened or something like important happened and people were thinking or wondering when Persona 5 was coming out, John Harden and basically all of Atlas would always say 2015. I remember the one the one quote John Harden was like, I don't know why people are getting these ideas of Persona 5 be coming out in 2016. The date is 2016, 2015, and that's it. He said it. He said literally exactly that. So like what's going on here like if it was a slight delay like okay early 2016 and it was like last minute thing that's that's understandable but how do you go from you know end of 2015 to summer of 2016 uh, you know what i mean that's that's almost like six months or something like that and that that's a huge delay and like i said some people may take this bad some people may take this good because a lot of times people say the delay lets the game be as good as it needs to be, you know, no errors whatsoever. But at the same time, we wouldn't have a problem with it if they wouldn't push 2015 so much. If they maybe like hinted at 2015 where they said it like once or twice, that'd be okay. But like the fact that they were really trying to push and persuade us that it was 2015 is very, very confusing. You know, I don't get that. You know, what's the point? What's the point? Just tell us how it is, you know, especially the Persona fans. Like I see comments. A lot of people are like, yo, it's fine. It's fine. The game's going to be even better. I don't care about delay. You know, we, they don't really care. We don't really care that much it's just the fact that they lied to us is a big issue again also this is actually pretty good because the end of this year there's a lot of stuff coming out there's like bloodborne dlc um in the beginning of uh 2016 there's a good bit of stuff as well there's more other than bloodborne dlc i, I just couldn't think of anything the taken king i'm currently playing destiny right now um th there's a good bit of stuff to keep us occupied and then whenever 2016 rolls around there's gonna be a lot of even more stuff hopefully we get digimon story cyber sleuth um in the first half of of 2016 that'd be awesome because uh actually they just put out a new trailer i'll, I'll be covering that soon there's there's a good there's a lot of stuff to keep us occupied you know and i'm not even worried metal gear on metal gear solid 5 on Mega online 3 i guess they call it um will be coming out soon and that's definitely going to keep me occupied i still am only five percent into metal gear solid so that i need to do that but um yeah like i said so there's, there's, a, there's a lot of stuff to keep us occupied but i the sole factor is that they just lied to us so much you know they were kept telling us 2015 and all of a sudden they they say 2016 and a lot of people knew this was going to happen a lot of people were saying this That's, this is why my video a lot of people were like yo even whenever they they heard the confirmation of john harden saying it with his own two freaking lips people were still in the comment section saying yo it's not happening like it's not coming out in 2015 no matter what and i'm just like what's wrong with these people you know because i'm i'm a new persona fan so i don't exactly know how you know atlas runs their stuff and <laughs> now i see <laughs> i see what what's going on here you know but um that's basically everything um like i said the trailer. i think i've been showing the trailer in, the, in this video yeah it, it's a crazy trailer. it looks so good oh my god i cannot wait and also this also g g gives me more time to finish my persona 4 let's play 
hopefully by summer 2016 we're still done hopefully i need to upload the next episode actually matter of fact i'm gonna try to do that this weekend but yeah so it gives me more time you know it lets me help helps me get to finishing persona 4 um, so i'm gonna have to hurry up and get through that you know beginning of 2016 i'll definitely have to rush and go through that and whatnot but um other than that let me know what, you, what your thoughts are about this in the comments below are you mad are you sad because i'm i'm probably i'm like sad and okay with that at the same time you know i have, I have a middle feeling it's, it's just, i'm just like whatever you know whatever so let me know what you guys think what are your thoughts um are you mad did you did you guys predict this did you predict it let me know because i predicted it wrong <laughs> can't predict everything can we um but uh yeah so let me know what you guys think in the comments below but other than that i'll see you guys later peace